weather manipulation has been occurring since the 50s. The topic is however still hotly debated. From chemtrails to harp both sides have their evidence. But is there a weather phenomenon that could prove once and for all there is a program to manage, produce and manipulate weather and climate? Has there been any evidence which is so undeniable it can prove the claims of those that say our climate is controlled? Welcome to IF, Weird Facts and Strange Science, videos posted twice a week, hit that red subscribe button and ring that notification bell and join the journey into mystery. Climate control and weather manipulation is a topic which has been debated for years, the warming climate being blamed on the industrialized world. This idea of global warming being the fault of man has its opponents. They give much evidence to their claim that this is a natural cycle of the global climate and that extreme weather events are being created to control a worldwide agenda of climate engineering for profit and for war. The streaks of chemical clouds crossing the skies being one of the most highlighted forms of evidence. Those that support man-made global warming claim that these trails are nothing more than water and exhaust vapor from the plains, contrails, which have been seen since the first days of manned flight. The argument over these chemtrails or contrails is not something I want to go into here today. We did take a look at them in a video linked above. But what if there was a cloud formation that could show it was 100% created by man? A clearly unnatural formation that would show someone is creating our weather. How about clouds that form into cubes? Are these bizarre square clouds proof of weather creation using the HARP project? Video has come to light that claims to show these strange clouds. Footage was shot in Tuscan, Arizona in the USA. It has sparked online debate, many claiming that these images are the hard proof they have been looking for to support the claim that government is manipulating our weather. The massive formation spans the skies and is indeed very strange. These clouds having what appears to be a very regular geometrical shape, the angles being a perfect 90 degrees. Were these clouds the work of the infamous high frequency active auroral research program HARP? The US government has been using this research center since 1993 and it is run jointly by the US Air Force and US Navy. The top secret facility has been the source of many claims that the armed forces are attempting to weaponize the planet's climate and weather. People say that this base has capabilities ranging from the creation of storms and excess precipitation to earthquakes and scorching heat waves. Conspiracy theorists are convinced it was really set up to research how to use artificial weather as a weapon against other countries and even how to trigger earthquakes and volcanoes. The area is now run by a private institution and they say that they carry out routine analysis of the ionosphere. These investigations researching the potential for developing isopheric enhancement technology to boost radio communications and surveillance capabilities. These public communications of an innocent research program have been thought to be just a cover story. Even some world leaders think that this facility has a dark agenda. Venezuelan leader Hugo Chavez even claims HARP was used to trigger huge tremors including the 2010 Haiti earthquake. But let's get back to our square clouds. The idea that these are created does stem from the shape many thinking that nature does not create such angles and perfect forms. The problem here is it does. There are many examples of nature's ability to create natural formations that look distinctly man-made. From structures that are used as markers by astronauts like the eye of the Sahara. The eye of the Sahara a circular shape in the middle of the otherwise featureless desert area. This symmetrical uplift looking like a huge bullseye created by erosion. Another natural formation once thought to be terraces created by ancient man are the Pamukkale. 
this Turkish site being a series of basins filled with thermal spring water. Their white colour coming from the calcite deposited by the water as it pours over the edges of the pools. That calcite laden water also creates petrified waterfalls that look frozen in time. Other examples of natural geometrical shapes would be places such as the Devil's Causeway in Ireland or the formation of crystalline rocks. Until we see more concrete proof of Harp's effect on the planet, evidence will be continually gathered by those wishing to prove or disprove their point of view. What do you think? Are these clouds the work of the secretive research facility or are they natural? Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. If you enjoyed the video, please join the channel by hitting that red button and subscribing. If you would like to see more, you can find us on social media by searching We Are If. Thanks so much for watching. See you next time.